Hello everyone. Welcome to Red Duchess Farm. I'm Mark. I'm Jamie. And we got tagged by Andy's Tennessee Life and Homestead to do a collaboration that was originally started by Jim's In Town Gardening. And it's the top five reasons that we YouTube. And to be honest, the four are real easy to come up with. Figuring out the fifth one, we're just going to kind of wing it. So, uh, first reason I go to YouTube is for entertainment. Uh, just to go in and watch. I watch a lot of news things, a lot of history things, and that kind of that kind of stuff on YouTube, as well as all the channels that we follow. And then Jamie's got other things. I like to watch uh, a lot of the arts, art stuff, um, fiber stuff, that type of thing, and listen to music. I like to go in and listen to a lot of the music. So, yeah. So the, the <laughs> second reason that we YouTube is to learn, for knowledge. Um, there's a video on everything out there, as you all know. Uh, when Jamie bought the Prius and the time rolled around to change the oil. How do you change the oil on a Prius? You look under it and it's one big plastic sheet under there. So look up a YouTube video and find out where the little cubby hole is that the oil filter and the, and the drain plugs at and how to get into it. And, and so lots of things like that. Uh, you know, anything you want to learn how to do, there's videos on it. So. I go to YouTube for a lot of those sorts of things to learn. I guess the biggest question was how to drive that Prius. But anyway, <laughs> <laughs> the um, I like to I like to go on. Just this last week, I went on and uh, I just sit and search things every once in a while, and um, I found a new idea that I thought, hey, that's a pretty cool idea. I wonder if I can imply fiber to this idea instead of yarns and stuff like that and so I experimented with what they did and came up with a uh, whole new process of doing something so that was pretty cool this week so yeah I like to go and just dig around and and see how I can do things a little off the wall or kind of get ideas that I can change around. Uh, third reason is to share information that's the primary reason that I do videos, is to um, to show you what we're doing here on the farm. Try to uh, put some information out there that maybe all of you can find useful, uh, at least some of it. And um, so, sharing information is a big part of, of why I do YouTube. Yeah, I like to get out there and um, show you what's going on in a maybe in a way that a lot of people don't. Um, I'm, I'm going to drag you around out in the alpaca barns. There's not a lot of things out there along those lines. Um, obviously, I like to do the animal husbandry type stuff, and um, I like to I like to be able to teach. Say, for instance, you know, the ladies that are out there, or you know, the women, you know, what happens if something happens to your other half, and and you have to take care of the livestock by yourself and do this and that, and and I that's that's kind of what I do. So I like to show how to how to do that and if it means sliding on my butt through the mud and, and going about, the, about it in, in uh, a non-orthodox way, that's that's what I like to do. I like to just show you how it really is. And the next reason, number four, is um, community. <clears throat> and I like, really, really enjoy all of the interaction uh, in the live streams, uh, all of the comments on our videos, commenting on other folks' videos, and all of that interaction that goes on in this homesteading community. Um, so that's a, that's a big part of why I do too. I won't lie, I like to be nosy. <laughs> I like to see what everybody else is doing. I want to see what they're doing on their farm. Um, I will honestly admit I'm not one that just, I, I don't get a chance to sit and really watch a lot of videos. Um, in the morning when Mark's drinking his coffee and he's watching, catching up on the YouTube videos that just came out, I might catch one or two, three of my favorite ones and then I'm out the door and that's why I take care of the livestock and stuff. 
So I don't get to I don't get to sit and watch him quite as much as he does. But I mean, I'm curious. I'm curious what everybody's doing. You know, it's kind of interesting. So. And the fifth reason is also a community reason. Um, it's through YouTube and through the community. It's all the folks we've met. Um, we like the we like the YouTube thing because we go to the gathering in Mississippi. Um, I went to the HOA in uh, in Virginia this year. Uh, went with uh, Duncan 1900 Homestead. Met up with uh, met up with two family Homestead, um, and we all stayed in an Airbnb um, and just got to meet lots of other great channels. Got to meet a lot of people that we had met before and have become good friends with. So it's it's building these personal relationships and friendships uh, where we actually get together and, and get to visit and get to meet. That's a, that's a big part of it. Yeah, I haven't, um, I haven't gone to quite as many gatherings as he has. Um, uh, this last one, when they went to Virginia, um, it was time to AI, AI the cow. So I stayed home and did that and, uh, and uh, stuff like that. I'm, I spend a lot of time when I'm doing my, my art shows and stuff talking to people, but other than that, I'm kind of the one that wants to kind of, I just like to stay back here and, and I don't socialize quite as much, but once I get to know people, I really, you know, I really like to have fun. And it's actually introduced me to some, some new people and, and I've caused a bit of trouble before, <laughs> while, we're, while we're out and about. So, um, so yeah, it gets me out there and it, it gets me meeting people who are a little bit more like-minded. So it's, it's pretty cool. So that's our five reasons that we YouTube. And uh, now we need to tag a couple people. Uh, gonna tag Lee and Teresa at Stringfield Ridge Farm. They're almost neighbors of ours. And uh, so let's see the reasons that that you all YouTube. And Brenda at Duncan 1900 Homestead, you need to put out a video anyway. You see your face. <laughs> so, uh, so five reasons why you, why you YouTube. And the uh, next thing on the agenda, I need to grab the hat over here that's got names <laughs> folded up in it and we need to do a drawing to see who wins our 500 subscriber giveaway. So let me grab the hat real quick. Drum roll. <laughs> and oh, we'll note the hat. The hat. Jamie's first hat. This is the made. very first hat that I ever made. We'll stir them up and Jamie can draw one out. Oh, man, I can't feel it. <laughs> yeah, make the person who has no feeling in their hands. Alrighty. They'll waller it around for a while. <laughs> oh, look, it's blank. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> He's not very patient with me. Oh, for crying out loud. Jeeper for you. I believe that would be Bob. That would be Bob. That would be Bob. All right, Bob. He's one of our, um, he's one of our very, very, very local people. And uh, he really kind of supports us a lot. So that's, that's great. So, all right. Yep. So Bob, uh, we've got your phone number. You've got our phone number. So we'll be in touch and get things put together for you. Um, I think that pretty well wraps it up so thanks for watching from Red Dutch's Farm. You have a great day. <laughs>